Coding in Minecraft education is a lot of fun, and it's as simple as pressing C on a keyboard, if that's the kind of device you're using, or on a touch device, pressing that agent icon in the top center of your screen. Now, I'm on a keyboard device, so I just press C on my keyboard, and that opens up Make Code and summons our agent. So I'm gonna close Make Code real quick to be able to back up and show you who our agent is, You'll see it's your name and then agent listed out above it. But your agent is a friendly, helpful mob that is there to support you in coding and following the commands that you program it to do. Whether it's on planting or harvesting or mining or building, you can even give it inventory to complete some of those tasks. But I'm gonna go ahead and open up make code again by pressing C and we can go through all kinds of different tutorials to practice and learn how to code different things, have a lot of fun, explore that space, but let's go ahead and create a new project and we give it a name, Play Minecraft Education, and we create that. Now, this is going to open up a plain empty code space that we can build our program. Now, along the left side, we have our toolbox, which has all the blocks that we could use. There's even an advanced space, but in the center, we would then drag those blocks to then snap them together to build our program. And then we run that program by pressing that play button in the bottom right corner of make code. And then we have the ability to share what we've done, whether it's with a teacher or students or anybody, we can then share what we've created here in make code. Now that's a very quick tour of just the open possibilities, but you can code in block JavaScript and Python. So, Let's go ahead and do one of those tutorials very quickly. And let's do that chicken rain one. There's a lot of uh, options here, but chicken rain is a great one to get started with. It's a lot of fun to be able to see. And we're going to choose blocks for this tutorial. Now, every single tutorial will have a series of steps that you can follow along this left side, just left of that toolbox. Each one of those has steps that you can follow and you click through following exactly what's there. There'll even be little tips that you can see exactly what you should have in your workspace that you can follow. Uh, every one of those toolboxes will have just the right blocks that you need to do. Now I've done this one many times. It's so much fun. So I'm going to quickly fill it in so we can see it run. So on the chat command, we rename this to say chicken. So when we type in chat in the world, it'll run this code and we're gonna change the repeat, this loop from four to 100 times. And what that's going to do is we're going to spawn a chicken and we're gonna set that so that it will spawn a chicken 10 blocks above us, wherever we are following that Y axis. So let's go ahead and we're gonna hit start or run that command that we've just created and go back to our world. So now I'm going to open up our chat and I can hit T or enter to open up chat and I then will type in chicken. So typing in chicken and then running that is going to run the command we just created. And if we look up, we see these chickens falling from the sky and there are a hundred of them. So just like in all the different lesson library options for coding, and you can learn to code in block and Python, but chicken and agent are so much fun to be able to work together. But sometimes if you're building in Minecraft education and you accidentally summon your agent, you by pressing C, you can remove the agent by doing a slash command. So we're gonna open up chat and hit forward slash and then remove. And then we have these options and we're going to do the at C and that's going to poof, remove our agent. Now, the, what you've done is not lost what you've created. You can always summon your agent again by pressing C and everything you just did in make code will still be there too. So have fun as you code and learn in Minecraft education. There's more to learn. Check out our Minecraft Teacher Academy courses and other learning opportunities at aka.ms forward slash mcgettrained.